Hey guys, it's Dave from Ghetto Van Adventures. I'm going to take you for a little look around Charlottetown, uh, Prince Edward Island, Canada. And uh, this is what they call the top part of Charlottetown. And uh, it's where a lot of the box stores are. This is where the Walmart is up here also. Now off to the uh, left of me is the uh, Bell Alliance Center and I guess that's a big complex, like a sports center sort of thing. And also right beside it is the University of Prince Edward Island. Now this is the, uh, looks like the Murphy Student Center right here too. still the university. It's actually quite a size to be honest with you on the uh, left hand side. A lot of the uh, spots on the right in there are uh, student housing. got the uh, Burger Joint, Burger King, Indigo, Good Life, CABC, you can see all that on your uh, right hand side. There's the RCMP, that's the Royal Canadian Mounted Police, that's their headquarters right there. On the left, Smitty's, that's a little restaurant. AFC, Timmy's, McDonald's. And I gotta get out of this thing. See, we got a lot of uh, a CBC also, like on the uh, left there, Coast Tire. Actually, Coast Tire, I went in there a few years back and they helped me out. Um, I got a Sobeys on the uh, left of me, Shoppers Drug Mart on the right. See how it starts to get smaller and smaller stores as you go uh, down towards the water. Now, in the summertime downtown, it is packed. Um, ships come in there's a lot of people downtown and it's good reason like and I'm gonna say this straight out so far like as it stands today like I haven't been in a few provinces for a few years but so far and yeah, there's a nice van um, so far Prince Edward Island is my favorite province it's really like really really clean uh, friendly 
the the places like you drive out in the country it's actually beautiful and it's a small island so you can travel all over the place like real quick but the downtown in uh, uh, Charlottetown um, absolutely beautiful I, I just love the old buildings and uh, you know it's the home of Canadian Federation 1867 um, you see how we're getting into the older buildings now, getting away from the um, uh, big box store sort of thing. See, this guy's waving people to turn. Like, in not many other places you get people saying, hey, you know, I'll slow down and you can turn. See, now we're getting down and it's, it's, there's a Canadian Forces recruiting base. Now we're getting down to the uh, uh, smaller areas. Now, a lot of restaurants, a lot of pubs. Um, Charlottetown is just great. Like, just beautiful in the old buildings. But the, like, if you want to wander around, like, I wander around Charlottetown. Every time I'm here, I wander around for hours hours like I'm exhausted usually when I finish with this town um, or should I say city but it is absolutely beautiful some of the uh, some of the buildings now these are all little Tom's Asian grill cotton wool ink the running room up street like all of these little I don't know what that is Sealand studio for the contemporary art is over on the corner building in front of us is I believe where Confederation was signed and unfortunately a lot of it is blocked off um, they're doing renos on and that's been going on for a couple of years now church on my uh, right just I'm gonna scoot down here well there's a tiny little car on your right okay I'm gonna scoot down here Churches and that. I'll get out and walk around and show you a little bit more of them, but it's absolutely beautiful. You know what? I'm going to grab a parking spot and walk on down to the water. Just gonna drive, and yeah, they got parking down there. There's the uh, food mall, the market on the uh, 
left. I've been in that restaurant straight ahead of us. Uh, lobster, the lobster wharf, delicious. And guess what I ate, of course, lobster. Now, I think you can park overnight here. I'm not really sure, but I think you can. But you have to pay for it. And I don't usually pay for parking, but I want to get you right down here. I'm going to shut this off. Isn't this beautiful? This is right down at the water. Mm, beautiful down here. Oh, and you see here. You know what that is? Mm, no, that's a wild rose. And they're everywhere. Isn't this beautiful? That's an interesting concept. Ice cream, delicious. Okay, PEI is known for the potatoes, but this is kind of funny for a radio station named the Spud. Interesting. See, look at that street, just full of houses like this. Nothing like tucking a sailboat in your street. The thing is massive. Beautiful old church. There's the Wellington. Two old buildings that at one time belonged to that church in the background right there. This is the street I came down. Oh, and in case you're wondering, Brits fish and chips, delicious. That taste of India is delicious. Over there.
mill they blocked off the street and they have the little pups off and everything else and it is just great at night. the other side of the little harbor.